my sweet, sweet souls, welcome back. I hope that you are good. So today we are doing Are They Into You? We're gonna look at the person that you're thinking of, um, the person that maybe you've got a crush on or if you're dating them or if you're just having a bit of fun with them um, or whatever your individual circumstances we're going to look at today. Deck number one, deck number two, we're using quite similar decks today. This one is the, the Lion Strider ta uh, Tarot, I nearly said tattoo, Lion Strider Tarot and this one is the Other Kin Tarot. Let's go. Date number one. So as always, it works on the strongest mutual energy between you all. You know how, how it all works now. Um, as always, I want to thank you for your love and support over the last few years. You're all rock stars. Um, and I am back to reading full time. Um, Hunter's going to be one next week. And like, I can't believe it. Can you? Like, oh my God, what happened? We blinked and I'm back off maternity and the baby's one. I can't, I can't get over it. I'm shocked. So... Let's see. Let's go into your person's energy and see what's going on. Are they into you? Okay, so I'm getting the song and I can't, I don't know who sang it. Um, I'm going to be completely honest with you. Sometimes when Spirit gives me music, um, I really haven't got a clue who sings it, but I just hear the lyrics. Um, and the song that I'm getting, the lyrics are, I really, I really, 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 really like you. Do, 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 do you like me too? Do you remember that song? Um, I, I think it might be a little bit old. I, I can't remember. Um, but yeah. So straight off the bat, with Spirit coming in with that song, um, I really, really, really like you. They're saying, yeah, they are into you. Straight straight away. Um, I am clear audience, so I hear Spirit as if me and you are having a conversation. When it comes through my right ear, it's always your higher guides. Uh, when it comes through your left, my left ear, it's normally guides that are connected very, very closely to you. So it's coming in through the right ear, so it's a higher dimensional guides coming in with that song. So, are they into you? Let's start off with the fact that you've got two pages. Ta-da! Okay, so the pages will symbolise the fact that they are into you. This is kind of a very new energy coming through forward, quite a fresh energy between you guys. Um, also, with it being the Page of Swords, this is talking about communication. So there's been potentially communication that's been happening with you guys, and if it hasn't happened yet, it's going to be happening in the kind of immediate future with the Three of Wands next to it likely to be through internet okay so if you're waiting for a message on instagram facebook social media whatsapp this is where the likely communication is going to come through and it is going to be some form of offering so what are you up to do you want to meet up should we go out on a date fancy a coffee should we go train together at the gym that kind of jazz you've got movement coming in and it's quite a rapid quite a rapid movement like it's happening now it's happening in the next couple of weeks um so immediate energy coming forward that yeah they really like you and they want to see where this is going so messaging communication all kind of aligning in your purpose and what you need and um, you've got a little bit of naivety with two pages here it sometimes they're going to come over as a little bit immature so they might tell you everything that you want to hear um, so just be aware of that. Make sure that their actions marry up with their words. It's because they're going to get really caught up with the moment, caught up with their emotions for you, caught up with their feelings. So you need to make sure that their actions marry up with their words. With the Page of Pentacles stepping in with the Page of Swords as well. So this is your communication coming forward, likely to be internet based. Page of Pentacles, this is them making some kind of offering to you. They're like, hey, I've got a pentacle. Do you want some of this? Do you want to try out my pentacle? Sounds a bit kinky, doesn't it? Um, but it's all about kind of offers of stability and security. So they are thinking that this can go the distance. They are thinking that you guys can um, merge into a relationship with one another, especially if the three of ones next to, to both of these cards. So creating action, movement. So absolutely into you, yes. The other two cards you got were the Six of Pentacles and the Magician. So quite a quick reading because it's, it's very, very positive, which is what we like. Energies aligning for both of you. Uh, this is what you've wanted for quite some time. Perhaps this person is quite a fresh face that's just stepped into your energy, stepped into your emotions, stepped into your energetic feelings. Field, but either way this can go the distance and with the six of pentacles next to it showing that this relationship is really going to be a game of giving and taking it's like you have this equal balance spirit saying to me very clearly equilibrium so your energies are equalized your energies um 
are quite powerful together and they align in the purpose that you want them. So when we're asking, is your person into you? The answer is absolutely yes. And we go back to that song very much at the start. I really, really, really like you. It's right here. And this can go the distance. This has got a really positive future. Sorry, I've got a bit of allergy today. My nose is running, my eyes are streaming. But if I look like I'm walking through a hedge backwards, that's, uh, that's why. Um, so let's just ask what the future is of you and them. So we know that there's movement. We know that there's action. Um, let's just get a card for the future energy. Ooh. Okay. Future energy. We have got the nine of ones. Okay. So... You might find with this situation, even though it's going full steam ahead, everything working out for you, it's important that you guys take your time with it. And um, there has potentially been hurt, circumstance, hurt, pain and circumstances that have happened uh, either with your person or with you. And it's a case of once bitten, twice shy. Very important that you take your time with this for this relationship to really succeed and go forward taking your time, trying to let the wounds of the past heal. Um, and if those are wounds that have happened with this person already, you can overcome these with all these cards over here. They can, You can overcome them, um, but do make sure that you are taking your time with it, okay? Um, because sometimes wounds can reappear and can resurface if they haven't been put to bed properly. So if this is someone that you are asking about that you've got history with and it's painful and there's 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 echoes of the past all lingering in today's energy you can move forward from it you can move forward from it but do and do do take your time and with that i just got a chase and status time for delilah and um, lizzie like D &B. um you can tell i was like party animal a few years back um <laughs> D &B, um time feet Delilah, uh, Chase and Status, if you can find the time, give your love to me, just drop me a line and tell me where you'll be, but if you can't find the time, then cut me loose. So you have got this energy of let's work together, let's move things forward, um, and then I just got another song for you, you're getting a play playlist, I got The Streets, you remember them as well, oh my god, we had them a few weeks back, like who listens to The Streets these days? Um, move Things Forward by The Streets, literally that line. Um, and for those of you that aren't from England and have never heard the streets before, um, you, you can go and have a listen. Um, <laughs> see what you think. They were massive when I was like in my twenties. They, they were they were uh, they were really really big. Um, in my days in Coventry when I used to live in Coventry, massive the streets for them. But uh, now in twenty twenty two, I don't don't really think people listen to them anymore but move things forward by the streets coming up you can shift this in your favor and just go gentle and those of you that this is a fresh energy it's brand new it's coming they like you they really 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 like you and that's deck number one okay so let's just skip forward to deck number two i am just going to have a spruce uh, just to clear the energy and if you just tapped in tuned in turned on and my eye is streaming at you and my nose is running a little bit, just bear with me. I think I've got some kind of allergy going on today and I'm just a bit sniffly. Okay, deck number two. Let's see what's coming in. What's, what is your person? Do they, are they, do they really like you? Do they like you? Are they into you? Think about your person for me. Let's get that mutual energy between you all. A little bit of a blocker. Let's try that again. Mutual energy, that's it. Lovely. Okay, let's go. So do ooh, ooh. do they really like them? Do they like those watching? Deck number twos, people. Are they into them? So this is a collective reading. Obviously, if you need me and you want to have a look at your circumstances individually, just drop me a message at mrlovetarot at gmail.com and we can see what is happening with your individual circumstances. Three. God, I'm right sniffly. Four. Five. Okay, I'm stopping at five. Because five is all we need. Right, do they like you? Well, there is a sense of confusion going on here, probably with you guys as well. You're not really sure what your person is thinking, what your person is feeling. Are they into you? And you're probably, in fact, definitely getting mixed messages. So you've either had been like 
bombarded with lots of love energy and then it stopped you've had a bit they've ghosted they've given you a little bit they've taken it away and you really are left in a state of confusion now what i find quite interesting with this is that your person is in this state of confusion as well so we have got a mirroring energy happening which suggests that this is more of a um kind of a higher vibrational relationship so a twin flame um higher vibrational soulmates perhaps there's a little bit of karma but we have this echoing and mirroring energy and you two are like magnets so you either get really really drawn to each other or you kind of repel and i don't know if you ever tried to push magnets together at school i, I know I, I never succeeded don't think anyone ever does but it's kind of like that pushing really stuck together merging to this repelling and it almost changes um, on a daily basis. Like you, you really don't know where you stand with your person. They're giving you very, very mixed messages and they have got this sense of confusion over it all. Let's ask, why is your person so confused? Why is your person confused? Okay. So, looks like they've been hurt in the past. Strength card coming up. Um, looks like they want to make sure they are making the right decisions before they tell you how they are emotionally feeling for you the reason for that is because if they open up too soon they might feel that they're feeling a little bit vulnerable and they don't want to do that they want to take their time with this they want to take the time with this and it's it, that is why it's giving you these mixed messages so one second they're like yeah i'm really into you and then the second next second you feel like they're pulling away um they can see a future with you but at the moment they just want to go very very gentle and i just got um the eagles taking it easy coming through my right ear then uh, the eagles taking it easy they can see a future with you but there is this sense of confusion coming with it because they want to make sure that they are making the right choices before they settle down into a relationship and that's why you guys feel like you've got whiplash we've got seven of wands coming up over here so with seven of wands and strength there is this uh this energy of i'm going to protect myself I have been hurt in the past. I'm not going to let anyone break through these walls until I know that they are the person that I'm going to spend the rest of my life with. That's what's going on. Okay. And that's what these mixed messages are. The other side of things on the flip side, you've got the page of cups and the four of wands. So even though they feel that they are on the self-defense, they can see a future with you. There is offerings coming in. There is offerings of love. There is offerings of romance. There is offerings of things working out, celebrations, weddings, and engagements. So they can see a future with you, but it's just a little bit of a taking time energy. And again, taking it easy with the eagles. They want to make sure that you are the right person. Um, messages absolutely coming through with the Page of Cups. You can see letters sprinkling all around him. Um, we've got the frog on the Four of Wands as well. And we all know that you've got to kiss a couple of frogs before you find your prince. It's a case of that with this person um, that it is going to take that time. It's going to take that both of you investing on um, in one another for these progression routes to move forward. But they can see that you've got a future. Okay, They do see that. Um, but they just want to take it easy. So are they into you? They are immature sometimes. They are on the cusp of this going the distance. Do they like you? They do like you, but they just want to take their time with her. Let it flow naturally. They don't want to force anything. Um, the more this situation naturally flows with them, the more this is going to move into your favour. So they like you, but, and the but is, but I want to take, I want to take my time and see where we end up. I don't want to force it. Let's just see what happens. Um, which can give you guys a little bit of frustration because you're going to feel as if you're not getting the answers from them that you want. Um, you're going to feel this, this conflicting energy from them. You're going to feel like you've got whiplash because you're not knowing where they stand. Um, if they kind of back away, give them enough space, um, let them deal with it. They will bounce back towards you. And I don't know if you guys have ever heard of the elastic band theory or rubber band theory uh, depending if you're in England or America 
but it speaks of when a person is really drawn to you as specifically males with this it's in men are from mars or men are from venus if you haven't read that book really recommend it um, but it talk about how they, they pull away like the elastic band and they have to stretch that maximum capacity to bounce back so when they start pulling away let them reach their maximum capacity and they will bounce back towards you and you guys can merge the energies together um so yeah they like you um but the bot is they want to just take their time with it um, which can lead to frustration from you guys uh potential yes it is that um but it is a case of just letting it all flow and like the eagle said take it easy take it easy and that's step number two so if you need me and you want to look at your individual circumstances drop me a message mystic love tarot at gmail.com i love you all to pieces i will speak to you soon um, many many goddess blessings your way uh my little mystic tribe ciao